NXT started with Tiffany Stratton versus Kiana James for the NXT Women's Championship. Tiffany would secure the win, and after, Becky Lynch appeared on screen, telling Tiffany that the man had won everything except for one title, the NXT Women's Championship. So it's time that the man came to NXT and informs Tiffany that they'll be facing for that title next week. Diamond Mine invite the tag division to their dojo to make it clear what they want. Later, Angel would nail Tony D'Angelo and a big brawl would break out. Ilya Dragunov took on Oro Mensa with Ilya suffering a brutal kick to the face, but would still manage to secure the win. After, Wesley told Ilya he needs to wait as he wants Carmelo first. Ilya doesn't seem to agree. Carmelo interferes and says next week it'll be Wes versus Ilya. Winner will face him. Backstage, Dom is seen reading a WWE rulebook and showing off his purple and black ref shirt as he will be a special guest referee later in the show. Blair Davenport calls Thea Hale a child. Gigi advises Thea to not hang around with JC Jane. Thea versus Gigi is made for later. Nathan Frazier would beat Duke Hudson in the Global Heritage Invitational. Next, Tyler Bate would shockingly beat Dabba Kato. And backstage, Roxanne and Kiana would get into a brawl. Dragon Lee took on Mustafa Ali with Dirty Dom as special guest ref. A quick count by Dom gave Mustafa the win. Mustafa would hit Dom after, but still celebrate the victory. Gulak, Dempsey and Kemp tell Miles he isn't ready. And Eddie Thorpe says he's not done with Dijak. Butch versus Axiom in the Global Heritage Invitational ends in a time limit draw. Next, JC tells Thea to not run to the ring and also to throw her megaphone away as Thea Hale prepares to face Gigi Dolan. JC distracts the ref mid-match as Blair Davenport comes down and attacks Gigi. Thea would go on to secure the win. Main event sees Bron Breaker take on Von Wagner. This is a brutal encounter with Bron being thrown into the platform area. He's also powerbombed through the commentary table, but somehow Bron would still secure the win. Afterwards, Bron smashes the ring steps into Von Wagner's head with the show being forced to cut to black, meaning the viewers at home can only hear what's going on. The show ends with sounds of chaos and concern. 